Here are three simple rules of exponents that every student in high school or college needs to know, or at least remember. So let's kind of do a quick review of them. In this first problem, I have x to the fourth times x to the eighth. So remember, the rules of exponent state, when I have an exponent with the same base raised to a power times another exponent with the same base but to a different power, you are now going to add the powers but keep the base the same. So in this case, I have x to the fourth times x to the eighth. Since they have the same base, that's going to be an x to the four plus eight, which is now going to give me a x to the twelfth. So just remember, when you multiply exponents, same base, you add the powers. Over here, now we have y to the twentieth divided by y to the eighteenth. Well, with multiplication is addition, then you can kind of think of division is going to be of subtraction. So again, x to the m divided by x to the n is equal to x to the m minus an n. So all we're going to do is subtract the power in the numerator from the power in the denominator. So in this case, I have y to the 20 minus 18 is going to give me y to the second power. Remember that. Quotient or division be represented by subtraction. The next one is going to be the negative powers. These two are very important. Most students kind of remember them. They don't forget them. But the negative powers always seem to trick students up. So just remember, negative powers represent reciprocals. So if I have x to the negative n, that is equal to 1 over x to the positive n. If I have 1 over x to the negative n, that is equal to an x to the positive n. So if you put it over 1, if you reciprocate it, you're going to go ahead and change the signs of the power. So if I want this to now be a positive 2, or that power to be a positive 2, all I simply need to do is understand where it is initially. You can see that this is initially in the numerator. So if I want that to be a positive 2, I just now need to reciprocate it to 1 over a 5 squared. These are the most basic and common rules of exponents that you all need to know.